This is the Great Crush Collision March. It was written by very popular ragtime composer Scott Joplin in the year 1896. And this is one of his earliest pieces. This is probably one of the most interesting stories behind any of his pieces. And it's a true event. There's a little town in Texas called Crush, which is in the United States. Hence the name, the Great Crush Collision March. Basically, there was a whole publicity stunt that happened when two trains decided to collide into each other. And to entertain the crowd, I guess, which is a very stupid idea. I don't know who thought of this, but... Mm. A month after the event, Joplin came out with a piece. Of course, it's called the Great Crush Collision March, and he does a really good way of expressing this event, even though he wasn't there. Being popular around this region, he decided to do this. Here's the part of the piece where it says, the noise of the trains while running at the rate of 60 miles per hour. This is supposed to mimic the trains about to collide to each other. They're like, coming at each other in a fast rate. All of a sudden, the spectators hear the noise of the trains and get excited. And these little things right here are supposed to mimic the whistle of the trains before the collision. And right here, you have to make it very loud while you play it. You bang the piano. Literally, in my opinion, it does not even matter what note you play. You just bang the piano to mimic the collision. Just don't break it. Joplin not being present at this event, yet expressing it in a good way, shows that everyone must have heard about it. And there's the very crazy story of the Great Crush Collision March. <laughs>